Thank you very much for visiting my channel. If not difficult, like and subscribe to my channel to always be aware of events. Thank. Remains of an ancient otter found in Ethiopia reveal the long extinct creature was the size of a modern lion when it lived more than 2.5 million years ago. Researchers uncovered teeth measuring more than an inch and a giant 12-foot-long femur that helped them determine the new species weighed 440 pounds today's otters weighs up to 13 pounds. The existence of giant otters is known. But the team led by Francis Camille Groet of the University of Poitiers believes the latest discovery is the largest otter that has ever roamed the earth. Because of its massive size, the new species is said to have feasted on aquatic and terrestrial prey and coexisted with early hominins in the same region. The team, however, speculates the giant otter met its demise when the wet climate became drier along with an invasion of hominins into their natural habitats. Study co-author Kevin Uno, a geochemist at the Columbia Climate School's Le Monde Doherty Earth Observatory, said in a statement, the peculiar thing, in addition to its massive size, is that, isotopes, in its teeth suggest it was not aquatic, like all modern otters. We found it had a diet of terrestrial animals also differing from modern otters. Fossils of the ancient otter were discovered in the lower Omo Valley of southwestern Ethiopia, which researchers used to estimate the now extinct otter's size. Several giant otters are known to have populated Eurasia and Africa from about 6 million to 2 million years ago, with genus Enhydriodon being the most well known. This is because its remains although fragmentary, have been found in many locales, particularly in eastern Africa. The newly described species, however, is named Enhydriodon amoensis after southwestern Ethiopia's Lower Omo Valley, where it was uncovered. The Lower Omo Valley of southwestern Ethiopia is located north of Lake Turkana. It represents the northern part of the large Turkana depression and it exposes Pleopleistocene fluvio lacustrine sediments on the western side of the Omo River. Mainly deposited as the Usno and Shungura formations, the team shared in the study published in Comptes Rendus per level. The Shungura formation is exceptional in Africa because it preserves a highly continuous, well dated, and rich paleontological and archaeological record from about 3.6 ma, million, to 1.05 ma, million. In 2017, a separate team uncovered remains of another giant otter. This one was the size of a wolf when it lived 6 million years ago. Known as C. Armogel Melalutra. It weighed about 110 pounds and had an unusually powerful bite which would have allowed it to crush mollusk shells or the bones of birds and small mammals. Researchers from the University of Buffalo studied the prehistoric otter's fossilized skull. The massive otter may have been a dominant predator where it lived in Shui Tangba, southern China. Scans revealed a combination of otter-like and badger-like cranial and dental feature. Because of this, the species was given the name, Melalutra, derived from the Latin melus, for badger and lutra. For otter. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe to my channel to stay up to date. Peace for everyone.